Welcome back YouTube. It's me Arjun. Today I am back again to guide you on Microsoft Word. Today's topic is how to create professional ID card in Microsoft Word. If you don't have an idea or not expertise on graphic software like Adobe Photoshop, Adobe Illustrator, Freehand, Corelra, uh, something those um, graphic software, then this video is for you. If you follow the idea up to the end of the video, I assure you that you can create professional ID card using Microsoft Word as well. Let's dive on it. First, open the blank document in the Microsoft Word. Then create a shape from the insert tab. Create a shape. You can choose a rectangle or rounded rectangle. I prefer to use the routing a rounded rectangle that looks more professional than the corner the rectangle one. Let me decrease the corner angle and if you really going to print this identity card I prefer to set the size as well as a 5.5 centimeter height and the it is 8.8 centimeter and press enter this one is the actual size actual professional size but according to your requirement you can increase or decrease the width and height accordingly if you don't want to apply the background just go to the shape format if you select this one you will get the shape format and from here just click the plain one or you can select from here and apply uh, any of the color whatever you want let's let's type some content here to type the content inside this rectangle box just right click and add text that's the easiest way and if you want to start typing from the beginning uh, go to the shape format tab align text and talk uh, let's start the typing with the company name that is ABC company and the address that is first address that is street address and country country name suppose and next one is suppose I'm we are going to design the identity card so the title identity card hit enter key again and start with a name uh, I forget to insert the reference number here or car number ref then name uh, so blank address then we have to validate you can add the content whatever you want here with multiple line let's align with the home then left align that is left align gonna insert the tab here as a center tab here and again the another one that is up to here then press tab again tab enter 
again tab then PPLIC and the applicant signature authorized signature let's make more professional using font like 11 all together left align up to here I want to apply center alignment want to increase the company name size of the company name font size let's apply the bold and underline as well make it a little bit smaller than the others and I want to insert the image here so let's select the rectangle then create here one if you want to insert the image inside the save then select the save format tab then save fill you are not going to fill the color you are going to fill the pictures that's why I select this one I have already saved the picture on the desktop as a sample picture then insert it will get the picture inside there if you don't want to apply the border then from the save format or from the picture format you will see from the save format tab you will see the background for this that is save fill and this one is the save outline no outline from there look the border it means the stroke of the rectangle is gone moreover if you want to apply the gradient it means multiple color or any pattern go and select save format then after save fill gradient select any of the gradient from here or you can select more gradient you will get the um, other option on the palette over here and select solid color gradient I'm going to fill the gradient here select the gradient one you will get the gradient multiple option over here you can control the color whatever you like if you don't want to apply multiple color just select and drop here like this you can move this one as well and if you want to change the color select this one or just click there and from the color icon there just click and select any of the color what you will like and again this one if you want to change the yellow to suppose like this you can change and there is the type as well you can change the radial or any of the option whatever you like or you can change the picture texture or pattern fill any of the pattern from the background like um, you can select and change the color like this mm -hmm. so look the pattern mm. gradient that looks more professional than the others for the time being but according to your requirement or according to your uh, style you can change whatever you want and let's change this title as well to bold change the color as well uh, to the white that looks more better than before mm 
and this one italic and if if you move this anywhere you can't control the picture from there that's why click the shape hold down the shift and again click the uh, outer rectangle as well then go to shape format then arrange then group or you can directly right click group then group now you can control this whole shape from here wherever you want to move then if you want to make the copy just copy then paste and change the content super easy isn't it if you haven't already please just subscribe my channel that would encourage me to make more video on coming future hit the bell and like button as well if you have any question leave the comment on the comment box hope this video is helpful for you thank you